dive into the chilling depths of The Haunted Christmas Tree, a spine-tingling story that unfolds in the frosty embrace of a countryside filled with secrets. Venture with the unsuspecting Anderson family as they journey to a Christmas tree farm with a sinister past where the evergreens harbor more than festive charm. Unearth the local legend that shrouds the landscape, where the trees are said to be possessed by spirits with their tragic tales. Brace yourself for a story that blurs the line between holiday cheer and supernatural fear. Deep in the heart of the countryside, nestled among the rolling hills, there stood a Christmas tree farm with a dark secret. Local legend whispered of a cursed land where the trees were said to be possessed by the spirits of those who had met tragic ends on the property. This chilling tale had become so ingrained in the community that few dared to approach the farm, especially during the holiday season. Yet, as December came, the lure of a perfect Christmas tree drew in unsuspecting families oblivious to the eerie occurrences that awaited them. One crisp winter morning, the Anderson family decided to make the annual pilgrimage to the infamous Christmas tree farm. Mark, Emily, and their two children, Rose and Jack, laughed and played as they roamed through rows of pine and spruce. The evergreen scent filled the air, and the snowy landscape seemed enchanting. Little did they know that each step they took brought them closer to the clutches of the supernatural. The farm's restless and vengeful spirits watched as the unsuspecting family moved deeper into their haunted domain. The atmosphere grew tense as the Andersons meandered through the labyrinth of trees. Mark, usually joyful and carefree, began to sense an unsettling presence. He glanced around nervously, but the dense forest of conifers seemed to close in on them. The family selected a majestic tree at the heart of the farm, its twisted branches reaching towards the heavens. Oblivious to the ominous energy surrounding their chosen evergreen, they cheerfully cut it down, eager to bring it home and adorn it with lights and ornaments. Strange occurrences plagued their home as the Andersons decorated their newly acquired tree that night. Ornaments trembled and fell without cause, and the air became unnaturally cold. Rose claimed to hear whispers echoing through the halls, and Jack insisted he glimpsed shadowy figures out of the corner of his eye. Mark and Emily dismissed these disturbances as mere imagination, attributing them to the children's excitement over the Christmas tree. Little did they realize that spirits had hitchhiked their way into their cozy living room on the tree. As the days passed, the paranormal activity escalated. What was once the tranquil Anderson household became a fierce battleground, pitting the living against the restless dead. The tormented spirits, fueled by anger and seeking vengeance for the tragedies that had unfolded on the land, now unknowingly incorporated into the family's dwelling, manifested their presence with shadows that danced at the edges of perception. Simultaneously, the haunting whispers, once faint, now swelled into an oppressive cacophony, wrapping the entire family in a chilling shroud of dread. Desperation set in as the Andersons grappled with the evil forces that now dominated their lives. Consulting local experts in the occult, they learned the grim truth about the haunted Christmas tree farm. To break the curse, they would need to return the tree to its origin, burying it on the very land where the spirits had met their tragic ends. With trepidation, the family returned to the farm, guided by the flickering glow of candles and a spectral presence that seemed to beckon them into the heart of the haunted grove. In the dead of night, beneath the tree's twisted branches that had once adorned their living room, the Andersons performed a solemn ritual. As they buried the evergreen in the frozen soil, an otherworldly wind swept through the clearing, carrying the anguished whispers of the spirits. The ground trembled beneath their feet, and the fabric between the living and the dead blurred momentarily. As the last shovelful of dirt covered the tree, an eerie calm settled over the Christmas tree farm, and the spectral presence dissipated into the night. The following morning, the Andersons awoke to a transformed landscape. The haunted Christmas tree farm, once shrouded in darkness, now basked in the soft glow of the winter sun. 
the evil spirits, their vengeful energy sated, had finally left their dwelling. The air felt lighter, and the ominous shadows that had clung to every corner of the farm had dissipated. It was as though the sun had chased away the lingering darkness, leaving behind a serene countryside untouched by the spectral turmoil that had plagued the Anderson family. The encounter with the supernatural changed the family forever. As they gathered to put up a new Christmas tree, there was an unspoken acknowledgement of the bond forged through the haunting ordeal. The memories lingered, casting a subtle shadow over their celebrations. Yet, as they adorned the fresh evergreen with ornaments and lights, there was a newfound appreciation for the fragility of the holiday season. Little did they know that their tale would transcend their own experiences, becoming another cautionary tale whispered around the roaring campfires during holiday gatherings. Their story served as a chilling reminder of the cursed Christmas tree farm hidden in the quiet corners of the countryside, where festive traditions could become a gateway to the supernatural. And so, dear viewers, the tale of the haunted Christmas tree farm ends. But remember, the line between festive cheer and chilling fear can be thinner than you think. Before you trim your tree this holiday season, consider the stories that linger in the shadows. If you enjoyed this spine-tingling journey into the supernatural, don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell for more tales that will send shivers down your spine. Hit the like button. If you dare to, believe in the things that go bump in the night. May your holiday season be filled with warmth, joy, and just a hint of mystery. Until next time, stay curious and cautious. May your nights be free of ghostly surprises. Happy holidays and good night.